is bad for you. Why? Because you're going into slavery. That's right. You're an Edomite. See, now I'm cutting, the, I'm cutting to the chase. Why am I going to slavery? Because you're an Edomite. You're an Edomite. What's your nationality? It's an Edomite. That's not a nationality. What's your, 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 your national origin? No idea. I was born in Boston. Okay, what was your father? Was he an Irish? Okay, so I guess he, he, he may be Irish, right? He's not Irish. He's not Irish. Is, he, is he Jewish? Swedish. Well, you better hope that you're Israelite. But anyway, give me um, give me Isaiah 14. Wait, but why am I going into slavery? If you're a so-called white man, if your line goes back to the Edomites, do you know anything about Edom or Esau? Yeah. So what do you know about Edom or Esau? Well, Esau... You know about Esau? Oh, you know about that. Brother Esau? Jacob's brother? Jacob's brother. Yeah. Okay, who are the God descendants? You, who are the descendants of Jacob? I think the Jews and then the Arabs are the descendants of Esau. Are you talking about the white Jews? There you go. I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, where the descendants of Jacob? Okay. Jacob was a black man. Abraham was black. All right? Isaac, his son, was black. Right. Rebecca was black. So if they were all black, what color did, did uh Jacob Jacob would come out? He would come out as a black man. Right. Now his brother Esau didn't come out as a black man. He came out as, I'll use this term, an albino. You see a black person that looks like a white person, right. they call him an albino. But guess what? White people are al al albinos too. That's a that's you're an albino, okay? You're depressing me. Well that's what well, supposed to be. Well you gotta get ready, man. If, if, if you're an Edomite, what is if this you're gonna an happen? Edomite, very soon. It's happening now, as we talk. Go ahead. Isaiah 14 and 1. For the Lord will have mercy on Jacob and will yet choose Israel and set them in their own land. Because you the first thing that you mentioned when I asked you your your religion, you said Christian. Right. And I said, what does the word Christian mean? You said follow of Christ. But go here to the book of Acts 11 and 26. Wait, can I say I'm going to show you a, a true Christian. Acts chapter 11, verse 26. And when he had found him, he brought him into Antioch. And it came to pass that a whole year they, they assembled themselves with the church and taught much people. These are the uh, apostles. Right. Go ahead. And the disciples were called Christians first in Antioch. So the only Christians were the true followers of Christ. Go from there to uh, John, St. John 4 and 19. John chapter 4 verse 19. The woman said unto him, Sir, I perceive that thou art a prophet. Our fathers worshipped in this mountain. This is a, a woman of Samaria. Go ahead. Our fathers, which thought she was a Jew, but the Lord, the, a, a transplanted Jew. Go ahead. Our fathers worshipped in this mountain, and ye say that in Jerusalem is the place where men ought to worship. Jesus said unto her, Woman, believe me, the hour cometh when ye shall neither in this mountain nor yet at Jerusalem worship the Father. Ye worship, ye know not what. We know what we worship. For salvation is of the Jews. So, in him making that statement, for salvation is of the Jews, he excluded her. Why? Because she was not a real Jew. Go ahead. But the hour cometh, and now is, when the true worshipers shall worship the Father in spirit and in truth. Go ahead. For the Father seeketh such to worship him. True worship. God is a spirit, and they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in truth. Go ahead. The woman said unto him, I know that Messiah cometh, which is called Christ. When he is coming, he will tell us all things. Jesus said unto her, I that speak unto thee am he. And he said he was, he admitted that he was the Messiah. Go ahead. And upon this came his disciples, and marveled that he talked with the woman. Yet no man said, What seekest thou? Or why talkest thou with them? The woman then left her water pot and went away into the city and said to the men, to the men, come, see a man which told me all the things that ever I did. Is not this the Christ? Then they went out of the city and came unto him. And then meanwhile his disciples prayed him, saying, Master, eat. But he said to them, I have meat to eat that you Let's know the Let's go back to the 19th verse. All right. Go back to the point, because our salvation is of the Jews. Right. Um, John chapter 4, verse 22. Ye worship, ye know not what. Ye worship, ye know not what. This is what the, the Christ said, the black Christ said to this, uh, she would probably be an uh, Ethiopian woman, okay? 
Because you have a group of uh, Palestinian Jews over there. Do you know what the word Palestinian means? No. It means false. I believe it's Latin, okay? Now what happened was, going back maybe 20 years ago, we, the real Jews, started waking up. So I believe to counteract that, the, the so-called Jews in Israel said, let's allow these Ethiopians to come to Israel and say, here are the black Jews. But they're not the black Jews. Let me ask you two questions. Go on ahead, go ahead. One, what's the mere group? We're Israelites. 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 Yep. Second, what denomination did you grow up in? Um, not just one denomination. That's right. Because my parents went from one church to this to that. So they, they jumped all over the place. But Protestant denominations? Christian Protestant, 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 Baptist. Uh, Baptist. Methodist, Jehovah Witness. You was raised as a Jehovah Witness. Jehovah Witness. Jehovah Witness. That's what we call it. But we found out through studying the scripture that we are the Israelites. We are the lost. Give me, give me, um, give me Matthew's uh, 10, 5, and 6. Matthew chapter 10, verse 5. These 12 Jesus sent forth and commanded them, saying, Go not into the way of the Gentiles, and into any city of the Samaritans, into ye not. But go rather to the... Read again. Read yeah. it slow. These twelve Jesus sent forth and commanded them, saying, Go not into the way of the That's Gentiles. That's called a great commission, right? Yes. He sent out the twelve. And this is what he told the twelve to do. Go ahead. Go not into the way of the Gentiles. Hold up. Wait a minute. I thought we were supposed to save Gentiles. This is what the Lord said. This is what the Christ said. Go ahead. And enter any of the, of the any city of the Samaritans into you not. Now he just encountered uh we read about in uh, uh St. John the fourth chapter. He had that conversation with uh that Ethiopian woman, which was a Samaritan. That's why he said don't go among the Samaritans, because they were Gentiles claiming to be Jews. So don't go to them either. Go ahead. But go rather to the lowest sheep of the house of Israel. Go ahead. And as ye go, preach, saying, the kingdom of heaven is at hand. So all the other nations are ex excluded. That's right. Including yourself if you're an Edomite. Mm. Jump down to the 18th verse. Verse 18. And ye shall be brought before governors and kings for my sake, for a testimony against them and the Gentiles. For a testimony against them and the Gentiles. So if you're an Edomite, there's nothing you can do. There's nothing you can do. You can go to slavery. That's the only thing you can do. And that's only right, man. We were, we were enslaved under you. Yeah, we're going to we, we didn't have a choice. No, yeah, well, provided that you're an Edomite. If you're an Edomite, then you're going into slavery. That's it. If for some reason... So it's not even worth worrying about. You're going. If you're an Edomite, you're going into slavery. That's it. That's, that's, that's it. That's it. Period. That's kind of so the only thing you can do is hope that you're an Israelite. I'm here so much. Thanks okay. I appreciate All right. it. Nice, nice Good meeting you, bro. You. All right. Thanks, guys. Take care. What's an Edomite? An Edomite is a so-called white man. Yeah. But that doesn't mean that all... That this, this guy right here, I forget his name, but this guy, he'll be talking about us.